Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into the world of photo editing with a fantastic new tool from ClipDrop called Generative Fill. I just got an email about it a few minutes ago, and since you enjoyed my previous video on Generative Fill features from Photoshop and Canva, I thought it would be cool to show you this one too. Now, if you're familiar with Adobe Photoshop, you might know about their Content Aware Fill feature. ClipDrop's Generative Fill offers similar functionality. Using Generative Fill is incredibly simple. First, head over to ClipDrop's website. They have a bunch of cool AI tools, but today we're focusing on Generative Fill. In a future tutorial, I'll show you all of them and even test them live. Simply upload your photo and you'll see the easy to use editing interface. Drag the image onto your canvas and use your mouse to make a selection. Today, I'll try transforming this Viking into a more humorous character by adding a Santa Claus hat. Just type Santa Claus hat in the designated field. Once you're happy with your selection, hit the Generate button. ClipDrop will analyze the surrounding area and intelligently fill in the gap, seamlessly blending it with the rest of the image. I really like the output. This is exactly the kind of creative editing you can achieve with ClipDrop's generative fill. But speaking of creative editing, if you want to see even more cool editing tricks and tutorials using ClipDrop and other awesome tools, consider subscribing to the Sumo Bundle channel. We put out new content all the time to help you take your editing skills to the next level. Now, let's do another test. ClipDrop uses artificial intelligence to understand the content of your image. I'll use another image with a different style, like a cartoon, to see if the Santa hat will look realistic or maintain the original style of the image. What do you think of the output this time? Do you like it or not? I'm impressed with ClipDrop's generative fill. Even if they announce a price increase in the future, I still think it will be worth it. Don't forget to leave a comment below with your thoughts on ClipDrop's generative fill. And if you have any questions, fire away. And as always, thanks for watching.